Reconciling your accounts with your bank statements is simple in iBank. Comparing your current bank statement with your records in iBank is the most dependable way to spot errors on either side. Reconciliation also allows you to see if any discrepancies between the two are simply a matter of timing. For instance, a check you've written that hasn't yet been cashed. When you receive a bank statement in the mail or via email, select the iBank account you'd like to reconcile. Then, click the Reconcile button below the Account Register or choose Account Reconcile with Bank Statement. The Statement view will appear on screen. Across the top of the screen are displayed all the statements you have previously reconciled. The middle section displays information about the current statement, and the bottom section shows a list of transactions available for reconciling. To create a new statement, click the plus button at the top right corner of the statement view. Enter the following information. Open balance. Enter the account's balance as of the beginning of the statement period from your bank statement. By default, iBank shows the closing balance from the previous statement. For credit cards and other liabilities, be sure to enter the balance as a negative number. Open date. Enter the starting date for the statement period. By default, iBank shows the closing date of the previous statement. Close balance. Enter the account's balance as of the end of the statement period from your bank statement. By default, iBank shows the balance recorded one month after the previous statement's closing date. Again, for credit cards and other liabilities, be sure to enter the balance as a negative number. Close date. Enter the ending date for the statement period. By default, iBank shows a date one month after the previous statement's close date. For the Automatically Reconcile drop-down menu, choose No Transactions to reconcile the statement by hand. Choose Cleared Transactions to have iBank automatically change all cleared transactions within the statement period to Reconciled, but leave uncleared transactions untouched so that you can reconcile them manually. The cleared transactions are indicated by a small check mark under the date. Choose All Transactions to have iBank automatically mark all transactions within the statement period as reconciled. Once you have configured the statement settings, click OK to create the statement. You will see a new icon appear in the top section of the statement view, labeled with the month and year of the statement's close date. Assuming the statement is not yet properly balanced, the amount missing will be displayed there as well. To reconcile a statement, select the statement you want to reconcile in the top section of the statement view. Then take a look at the middle section. Here you can see summary information about the statement, which will help you reconcile the transactions shown in the bottom section. The information you see in the summary section is as follows. Total value of all transactions on the statement that are marked as reconciled and have amounts in the deposit column the total value of all transactions on the statement that are marked as reconciled and have amounts in the withdrawal column. The sum is the total value of all reconciled transactions on the statement, equal to deposits plus withdrawals. The date fields show the same information you entered when you created the statement. Feel free to adjust them as necessary. The total is the expected value of the statement once all transactions are properly reconciled equal to the difference between the close balance and the open balance shown above. The missing figure is the difference between the value of the sum and the expected statement total. To balance the statement, this figure must be brought to zero. To reconcile the statement, check off the transactions listed in the bottom section of the statement view by clicking the circles along the left side of the list. By default, the register shows all transactions that are not reconciled on another statement. Compare the transactions that appear on the register to those on the printed statement from your financial institution. When a transaction matches, click the circle next to it to mark it with a green check. You will notice that the status of the transaction changes to the balance icon when the green check is present, indicating that the transaction has been reconciled. You can also add, delete, and edit transactions directly in the statement view if necessary. Just keep in mind that any changes you make here will show up in the account register as well. Each time you mark a transaction as reconciled, the summary figures in the middle section of the statement view update automatically. At the top of the register, you can see how many reconciled transactions are present and how many unreconciled transactions, cleared and uncleared, still remain. Continue marking transactions as reconciled that appear in your printed statement. 
A statement is successfully reconciled when the sum figure in the summary section matches the total figure and missing is zero. When you have successfully reconciled the statement, a green check will appear on the statement's icon at the top of the statement view. Sometimes, after you have finished reconciling the transactions in iBank with those on your printed statement, a discrepancy may still exist between your reconciled sum and the statement total. It's possible that this is a problem with the tracking of the transactions from your end or from the bank's end. Start by double-checking the start end amounts and the amounts of each transaction with your statement. If the amount is not significant, you can add a transaction with an amount equal to the difference. Click the circle to reconcile the adjustment transaction, and your statement should now be properly reconciled. Once the sum figure in the summary section matches the total figure and missing is zero, the statement is successfully reconciled. At that point, a green check will appear in the statement's icon at the top of the statement view. To complete the reconciliation process, click the padlock image in the summary section in the middle of the statement view. The statement will lock, and all unreconciled transactions will be removed from the statement view. You may return to the statement view at any time to review the statement and its reconciled transactions, but you will not be permitted to make changes to the statement without first clicking on the padlock to unlock it. Lastly, it's worth noting that transactions imported from financial software such as Quicken do not carry reconciliation status. You could create historical statements matching your bank statements going back as far as your records, but that may not be worth the effort. You can create a catch-all statement following the steps previously illustrated. The start date should be the same as the oldest transaction in the register, and the end date should be one day before the date on which you want to start tracking proper statements. The starting balance should be zero, and the ending balance should be the register balance on that date. Click the drop-down box to automatically reconcile all transactions. A balance adjustment should not be used with a catch-all statement. The ending balance should be adjusted as necessary to make it balance, or the statement can simply be left unbalanced in this case. The main point of a catch-all is simply to remove the old transactions from the statement view so that they don't interfere with future reconciling. For additional help with this topic, see the iBank help files under Statements and Reconciling in the Accounts section. <music>